events. He set everything uh, there for you. And with just one brushstroke, when you heed to the promptings of the Holy Spirit, uh, God, God's, God's perfect picture starts to come to pass. God's pe perfect masterpiece starts to come to pass. Why? Because you held on. You held on. You allowed him to do the work because you, you are not an island in this world. You are not an island. Just as you are asking God to bless you, he needs to bless somebody else so that that person's blessing can be your blessing. This is why I say celebrate other people's win because you don't know whose win is going to be attached to your win. You don't know whose dream coming true is attached to your dream coming true. You don't know whose victory is attached to you being victorious in the mighty name of Jesus. So we don't sit here and, and say we are jealous of people. We say, God, we thank you that we are in um, the sight of people uh, getting that breakthroughs we say god we thank you because you're doing it for my brother and sister and i don't know exactly how far in this line i am i don't know where in the neighborhood you are in but i know you will get to my house you will come knocking at my house and when you knock father god you better believe i'm gonna open because i've been waiting for this knock i've been leaning against that door saying father when are you gonna be in my neighborhood and right as you knock i will open because father i've been waiting for you i've been pressing on i've been praying i've been fasting and i know very soon you're gonna come and you're gonna knock Hey brothers and sisters, welcome to the channel. Brothers and sisters, I had not obviously expected to be releasing this video today, but I just had to. It's the 1st of August and you know, I I just had to, I had to. Like this testimony, I saw it first thing when I woke up and it moved me in a way I couldn't explain it. There was this bubbling in my spirit. So I wanted to say thank you to J um, Jesse Banks. I put it in the community tab and I will um, put it up here at the end my brothers and sisters so uh, Jesse uh, Banks uh, talks about how she she you know she's been waiting on the Lord waiting on the Lord and she got a sense she just got this feeling to put her house on the market and she did and she got in four days not only did she manage to get a buyer but she she got 17,000 above what she asked for and not only that she has been able to go and get uh, all her debt cleared, all her debt cleared, and is able to go buy it her dream car cash and this is what i just wanted to say to you brothers and sisters this is the message i wanted to come and share with you you see uh, most of the time when we are waiting on the lord we don't understand the fact that god is working in the background we don't understand and we feel like god is not doing anything when god is busy working in the background you see you might be saying god take me out of debt but god is saying with just one brush stroke with one brush stroke if you just wait on me I, it will take one brush stroke for me to go and deliver each and every single thing that you want it will take one brush stroke for me to not only clear the debts but to make your dreams come true in the mighty name of Jesus. You see, God, brothers and sisters, what you need to realize is that uh, there's a time when God timing steps in when it's time for God when it's God's timing and God is saying all I need is for you to take the action you have been patient you have been waiting you have been faithful now it's my perfect timing and all I need is for you to take action I have said before that every single time when I am going through something I remember the dream I had where I heard the Lord say to me that though you will be rewarded for your obedience. Brothers and sisters, you might be waiting, but when it comes to God's timing, there will come a time when you get that feeling, when you get that sense in your heart that I, I, I need to move in this direction. And if you follow that feeling, if you are obedient to that feeling, God says right there, you allow me with just one brush stroke to come and paint this beautiful picture that is your life that I have planned for you, uh, brothers and sisters. Um, 
when you are busy waiting on the Lord and you are saying, God, how, how he is going to do it is irrelevant. But as you are waiting, as you are waiting for that dream house, as you are waiting for that dream job, as you are waiting for anything that you are waiting for, you need to realize that there are other players in this, in this thing, that uh, in, the, in your dream coming true, in this word coming true. Just the same way like with Sister Jessie, as she waited for four years, what I'm trying to say to, um, to, 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 to you guys is that God had to go and and, and 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 work on the person who's who's who, who who would find her house to be their dream house hmm? that such that they were willing to to offer more exceedingly above what she asked for while she was waiting for god to move god was busy making somebody else want that house and wanted so desperately that they would be saying i am willing to pay above not only that god had to put the person who is buying that house in the financial position to be able to offer more god had to not only plant the desire for this person to love this house and the house to be their dream house but furthermore he had to give them the means that are exceedingly and abundantly above what they are willing to pay for the house and say no you are gonna get this house uh, above uh, asking price you're gonna get this house above what my daughter is asking for it not only because this is your desire and this is your dream but because she's also my daughter she's also my daughter she's been praying to me and i'm gonna bless her and not only do i want to bless her with the obedient by being obedient and putting this house on the market i want her to go and cancel out her debt i want her to be rewarded and go get her dream car in the mighty name of Jesus. So brothers and sisters, today is the 1st of August. I don't know when you are going to be watching this video, but this is what I'm going to say to you. When God's timing comes in, when it's God's timing, uh, uh, God allows you to, to, to step, to, 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 to act in faith. Um, you know, God says your obedience, your obedience, he, he orchestrated the events. He set everything uh, there for you. And with just one brushstroke, when you heed to the promptings of the Holy Spirit, uh, God, God's, God's perfect picture starts to come to pass. God's perfect masterpiece starts to come to pass. Why? Because you held on. You held on. You allowed him to do the work because you, you are not an island in this world. You are not an island. Just as you are asking God to bless you, he needs to bless somebody else so that that person's blessing can be your blessing. This is why I say celebrate other people's win because you don't know whose win is going to be attached to your win. You don't know whose dream coming true is attached to your dream coming true. You don't know whose victory is attached to you being victorious in the mighty name of Jesus. So we don't sit here and, and say we are jealous of people. We say, God, we thank you that we are in um, the sight of people uh, getting that breakthroughs we say god we thank you because you are doing it for my brother and sister and i don't know exactly how far in this line i am i don't know where in the neighborhood you are in but i know you will get to my house you will come knocking at my house and when you knock father god you better believe i'm gonna open because i've been waiting for this knock i've been leaning against that door saying father when are you gonna be in my neighborhood and right as you knock i will open because father i've been waiting for you i've been pressing on i've been praying i've been fasting and i know very soon you're gonna come and you're gonna knock at my door so brothers and sisters obedience pays off god's timing will come when his masterpiece is about to be completed and with just one brush stroke he won't just give you what you're asking for he will give you exceedingly abundantly more he says you think i'm gonna come and take care of the needs i'm just gonna come and give you just what you need for provision i'm just gonna come and clear the debt ah uh -uh, baby i ain't gonna do that i'm gonna clear the debt and give you the thing that you dreamed of you see i don't want you to go and buy the thing that you think is just okay I I want you to go get that thing that you dreamt of, that you pinned, that you said, this is the thing that I'm going to use to celebrate when I arrive at my harvest moment. Oh, brothers and sisters, as we walk into August, let us be expectant and let us say, God, yes, I might have not seen you move in the last few years, but I tap into this and I say, I know right now you might be blessing somebody and that person's blessing is attached to my breakthrough. That person's blessing is, the, is, is attached to me 
me getting to where you said you're gonna take me so I'm gonna be patient in w letting you do the work father God I'm gonna be patient in letting you uh, orchestrate the events for my breakthrough to come to pass in the mighty name of Jesus uh, so brothers and sisters this fired me up oh this fired my spirit this did a move on me and it just tell, told me oh baby oh it's happening oh the, the the heavens are open and all you gotta do is just wait patiently on his knock on your door and when he knocks you better not stutter you better not um, uh, like you better open that door in the mighty name of Jesus oh brothers and sisters uh, I have a blessed month let's go in it with a conviction let's not be sitting there saying God I waited uh, 10 to 5 seven years let's not put weight on the things that uh, the time that you've been waiting I better have you go put in in the comment section and say God uh, 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 it's been seven years that you've been working on my breakthrough you've been orchestrating it it must be big that because I've been waiting for so long I've been waiting for so long so it might it, it surely it's gonna be mind-blowing if you had to take so long to make it come to pass. Oh, brothers and sisters, be edified. Hold on, hold on. God is gonna just blow your mind. All these things I say in the mighty name of our Savior, Jesus Christ, amen.